Boys and girls, I'm Miss Abrams, and the book that I am reading today is called Do Not Open This Book. Please vote for my book. All right, before we read, um, there's a song that we sing in my class to get us ready. It goes like this. Everybody look now. Teacher has a book now. Won't you please be quiet? Quiet. So the title of this book, like I said, is Do Not Open This Book. The author is Andy Lee, and the author writes the words. And it's illustrated by Heath McKenzie. And what's the illustrator do? Yes, the illustrator draws the pictures. All right. If you like my book, vote. All right. What the heck? You turn the page. Did you hear okay? I'll put it down to a simple misunderstanding, but I'll say it once more very clearly. Please don't turn the page. Should I turn the page? Okay. What are you doing? I told you do not turn it. You definitely heard me. Look, I was very reasonable when you opened the book, but this is too much. Whatever you do, please don't Turn the page. Should I turn it? Should I turn it? Okay. You did it again? Are you mad? Are you not thinking straight? You're now in danger. I'm telling you as a friend that you definitely don't want to see what's on the next page. A young boy saw it once and his hair turned white with fear. Whatever you do, please don't turn the page. Ooh, I don't want our hair to turn white, so I think I'm just going to stop right here. Should I keep going? Should I keep going? Okay. Okay, okay. I lied. I lied about the boy's hair turning white. I'm sorry I lied. But you don't understand. You must stop what you're doing. Oh, Mr. Charlie, if you turn the page, I'll never speak to you again. Never, ever. Please. Don't turn the page. I think we have to. Let's go. Uh oh, he's mad at us now. I don't want him to be mad. Maybe we shouldn't turn the page. Should we turn the page? Let's go. Ooh, he's real mad at us. Mm. Uh oh. Ah! You did it again? Even after I gave you the salad treatment? Right. Okay, I'm going to tell your parents exactly what you're doing unless you put this book down straight away. I mean it. Please don't turn the page. You want me to tell your mother? You want me to tell your father? You better listen. Don't turn that page. Let's turn it. Wow, okay, I warned you. Now I'm calling your parents. Mom, Dad, your child keeps turning the page and must be punished. Send them to their room. No dinner for a week. Confiscate, that means to take. All books, including this one. Ha, see how you go turning the pages now. <laughs> ooh, ooh, he showed us. Should I turn the page? Oh, good golly, you can't be stopped. Please, please, don't turn another page. See, I'm crying now. I'm begging. It's serious. If you get to the end of this book, I'm done for. I'll do anything. You want some gold? I'll get you some gold. You want a flying car? I'll make one for you. Just please don't turn the page. Am I going to turn it? Yeah. Right. Seems like you can't be reasoned with. So go ahead. Turn the page. That's actually what I want you to do. Seriously, turn it. Oh, he wants us to turn it. Let's turn it. No! I was trying to trick you, but it didn't work. You mustn't turn the last page. Something awful will happen. You see, I once met a terrible witch who told me that if Everyone made it to the last page of this book. She turned me into a frog. So please, please don't turn the page. 
Now, guys, we don't want to turn him into a frog. <coughs> Should I turn the page? We have to. Let's see what happens. Uh-oh. Thanks a lot, Rabbit. We turned him into a frog. Do you guys feel bad? I do. Well, that's the end of our book. And here's a little chant we sing when we're done with the book. Three, two, one. Our story is done. Yay! If you like this book, please vote for it. Thank you. Oops, now I have to stop. Peyton, are you kidding me? I did all that and it didn't record? Oh, maybe it did. I